relatively short notice. It is utterly outrageous and it cannot be justified on any basis whatsoever. The Chinese government should be totally ashamed of this post. It, dis it diminishes them. It is utterly outrageous and it cannot be justified on any basis whatsoever. The Chinese government should be totally ashamed of this post. It, dis it diminishes them in the world's eyes. Australia is seeking an apology from the Ministry of Foreign Affairs from the Chinese government for this outrageous post. We are also seeking its removal immediately and have also contacted Twitter to take it down immediately. It is a false image and a, a terrible slur on our great defence forces and the men and women who've served in that uniform for over 100 years. It is deeply offensive to every Australian, every Australian who has served in that uniform, every Australian who serves in that uniform today. There are undoubtedly tensions that exist between China and Australia, but this is not how you deal with them. Australia has patiently sought to seek to address the tensions that exist in our relationship in a mature way, in a responsible way, by seeking engagement at both leader and ministerial level. I would hope that this rather awful event hopefully may lead to the type of reset where this dialogue can be restarted without condition, but we can sit down and start talking sensibly about these issues.